In the Maxmo application suite, Maxmo Manage now features an operational dashboard. The dashboard features a KPI display, quick application access, quick action access, and a workflow inbox. In the demonstration today brought to you by Maven Asset Management, we'll highlight the feature sets of the operational dashboard as of Mass 8.10. And just one quick reminder before we start the demo today, an operational dashboard is categorized as a tool. So if you don't see it in your Maxmo application suite environment, go to your security group app, filter on tools, look for the operational dashboard and make sure you have access to it. So let's go over to Maxmo and take a look. Let's start our demonstration today in the Maxmo application suite. So I've signed in and I wanna access Maxmo or manage. I click on my launch button and what will happen is my operational dashboard will display. I've enabled this by setting some security group settings and we'll show you those in just a bit. But let's focus first here on the dashboard. First, you can see the four pre-configured KPIs. I have the KPI title, my current status, if it's over or under target and what that value is. I can click on the icon to view the results in the KPI manager. That brings me to the historical trends by default. If I click on the KPI, I can see the SQL. I should, um, should highlight that I did modify the SQL here to reflect the environment I'm in. So I can again click on the cookie crumb channel and now I'm brought back to the dashboard. And I could do the same thing for all of those KPIs. If you look towards the bottom of the page, I have three other components that are available to me. Favorites, these are applications. Quick actions, if I want to create a work order or create a service request. And then my workflow assignment inbox. Let's draw your attention over here to my favorites. If I click on work orders, this brings me to the new role-based application. It's categorized as a tool in the security group application. And it shows me that simplified view of work orders. This is my default view. I can click on my um, bo box up here. Sorry, I lost the, the, the word that I was looking for, but I can click on that and then I could navigate to my different views, just like I can navigate to different queries as we do in Maximo. Notice as I've accessed this application, I don't have the breadcrumb trail anymore. So to get back to my dashboard, I just open up my action list or my navigation list and it brings me there. Another one that to draw your attention to, Workflow assignments, again, a new role-based application in the Maximo application suite. This shows me all the actions or the workflows that I need to take action on. You can see that I have two, so I gotta get going, look at those records and approve them. And I can click on those at any time to find more details. But let's bring you back here to the operational dashboard and just show you one last thing. Under the quick actions, if I did wanna create a work order, now you'll see when it brings me here, this is our traditional work order tracking view, and here is my cookie crumb trail. So if I wanna go back to that dashboard, click on that, and he'll take me right back there. Do I wanna save that? No, I'm good right now, so we'll go ahead back. So again, the operational dashboard preventing you a very simple look of your work order statuses with these various KPIs, my favorite launch, quick action launch, and workflow assignments. Operational dashboard is based on the new Maximo application framework or MAF technology. So if you were gonna configure it, you would do that in that Docker container. It's not available for configuration in App Designer. So one last thing that I wanna show you here, if I do click on my Start Center or my Home button, that is gonna bring me to the Start Center, not the dashboard. Let's go to the security group application and take a quick look at Max Admin. That's the group that I'm signed in right now. And let me show you how I've enabled this display. If I scroll down here, look under the default app, I've set that as the operational dashboard. So that enabled me when I went from Mass to Manage, that's what initially displays. Really nice feature there. And then if I click on applications, Let's do a quick filter here. I'm gonna filter again on a tool. And in this case, I wanna make sure that I've got that operational dashboard there. You can see, see how it's categorized as a tool and task. Gotta to make sure that access is granted. 
And that would be the same for our work orders and our workflow assignments, tools and tasks. Make sure you have access to those so when you see them on that operational dashboard that you can launch them. So great functionality available with the operational dashboard. Again, this is based on Mass 8.10. Continuous new features are being added in subsequent releases. Thank you very much for your time.